Hey guys, how's it going? My name is Alexander Can, and as you can hear from my accent, I'm French, but I'm originally from a country called Ivory Coast. I've been working online for the past two years and I've been traveling all around the world in five different continents and 34 countries so far. And when I do not travel, I'm based in Dublin, Ireland. So basically I work online to make a living and everything that I need is just a laptop and an internet connection. And most of my business is done through my travel blog but also my Instagram account. And this is something pretty unusual for some people and I totally understand the reason why. I was actually in your shoes not so long ago and uh, this type of lifestyle didn't really make sense to me. But I was always very curious to know more about all these digital nomads and how they managed to afford this type of lifestyle working just from their laptop all year long and traveling the world. So this is mostly the reason why I decided to make this video to share with you guys the process that has allowed me to be where I'm at today. So my story is pretty traditional. I follow the traditional path. I went to school, I went to university, I got myself a degree and then I found myself a job. And uh, it was when I got my first job, I got the opportunity to work in a multinational tech company and uh, the only thing that I wanted to do is just to prove myself, right? I, I was young and I needed to have more experience within my work and I didn't want to disappoint and lose this opportunity to work in this company. So um, I tried to climb the corporate ladder, I worked hard, I worked all the time and I did not really pay that attention to all the signals coming down my way and uh, it, didn't, it did not miss because I did a burnout and it really affected my health but also my relationship with other people around me. But it is also when I realized I would not have any control in my career because uh, when I had my performance review I still remember my manager uh, just uh, ticking boxes on a sheet of paper and, and just giving me like thank you for your contribution for this quarter and that's it. I didn't have anything else, no bonuses, no promotion, nothing at all. And this is when I had what we can call a wake-up call um, and I decided to actually uh, find another way to make money that will actually complete me, that will actually fulfill me uh, in my life. And I still remember that I assisted to a speech from a man called Nando Parado who had a near-death experience and who asked a question during his speech to the rest of the crowd and said, if you would happen to die tomorrow, would you be happy with the life that you have lived so far? And I still remember the crowd to be <laughs> silent. Nobody said a word. And it is normal, like, for people from all, like we were like in our mid-twenties, this is not really something that you think about. It's not everything that you want to do is to make money, have fun, party, travel, uh, and that's it. Like we believe that we are immortal. But, but if you start thinking that you might not be here tomorrow, then you see life with a different perspective. I still remember that it, it was really something that shook me inside. And he finished his speech by saying a quote that has become my motto for my travel blog, which says, life is short, create memories. And that really resonated with me. And that was actually something that really pushed me to take control over my life. And that's when I decided to create my travel blog in 2015 uh, that I named The Millennial Nomad. And uh, what started as a way for me to share my experience with my friend and family uh, slowly but surely started to get bigger and bigger and I had a community of people following my travels all around the world via my Instagram account but also following my, uh, my journeys through my travel blog posts that I will post on, uh, mostly on Facebook. And um, this when I was like, okay, maybe there is a way for me to make a living from it. I saw many people uh, online like travel bloggers that I followed that became actually vloggers thanks to YouTube and uh, started to make a living from it, but I had no idea of how to do it. And if you believe that you will be able to make money as a travel blogger from one day to another, this is actually a myth, it does not happen like this. You really need to have some marketing strategy uh, in order to promote your business and your travel blog, otherwise you will never be able to make money as a blogger. So I kept going, I kept searching on a new way to make money online, and that's when I stumbled upon a program that, will, that actually helped me to create, set up and scale up my business and since then I started to make my first money online. As you remember like as when I made my first couple dollars online it was unbelievable because this was actually something that was real. I was leveraging a system, an online tool that is actually generating me money in real life and I was 
amazed. I was amazed because that was something that I was never thought of. And I was mostly amazed because I was doing something that I loved, but I still managed to make money from it. So it was even like better. And uh, so I kept on going and I kept on going. And what started as a couple dollars transformed into a couple hundred dollars and finally transformed into a couple thousand dollars that I was earning per week. So I was basically earning as much, if not more, than what I used to earn working full time. And working for building a dream of someone else rather than building something on my own and living from what I love. So this is the main reason why I started to work online and quit my corporate job in order to focus full time on my online business. So there are many ways for me to make money online. I mostly use my travel blog to make money. And how do I do it? It's mostly by putting affiliate links here and there within my blog post. Every time I will publish a blog post, there will be links that will redirect you to a program or to a product that I personally use because I don't like to promote anything that I do not use. I like to be authentic in what I do so and that my readers and my audience know me through the content that I provide and they know that I'm serious about what I, what I, what I do. So if I'm promoting something, this is actually something that I'm using. So if it is benefiting me, it could benefit you and it's just, uh, yeah, it's just the way it works. And if you would like to buy it, then I will gain a percent of a commission from the sale and, uh, and yeah, that's how I earn some, some money online. And uh, it is something that is becoming more and more popular and it is just a way to promote a product that you love and sell, and sell it on the behalf of the company that offers this kind of affiliate programs. Another way for me to make money is through my ebooks. So I mostly wrote those ebooks in order to share my experiences as a travel blogger, but also as an online entrepreneur and provide you guys with actionable steps that I personally used that you can actually replicate for your own business and start making money online. And to provide you also another example of making money online is uh, via Facebook ads uh, because that comes back from my personal background in my professional life as I used to work as a social media advertising consultant and uh, I provide services for my clients uh, to set up their Facebook ad campaign and advise them on advertising products that they could actually use in order to promote their business. So as you can see there are many 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 ways to make money online and honestly the sky is the limit. So with all the tools available nowadays you can you can start making money online from tomorrow if you really desire. And, but one thing that I want to be clear about is that I'm in no way a guru and that I respect people who are working their full-time job and love what they do. But if you're watching this video today and you are anything like me, then chances are that you think differently. And if you're ready to start your own business and get off your comfort zone and really start taking control on your life, then with the internet, there has never been a better time than right now. I am proof that if you work hard, you can make anything come true. This was not easy, obviously, but it takes time and dedication to get there. But as long as you have the right mindset, I can assure you that you will create the life that you have ever wanted to. And I'm not the only example. You can have yourself a look online, and I, I'm sure that you have been exposed to many vloggers or many online entrepreneurs who from one day to another quit their corporate life in order to focus full time on their online business. So it is not too late for you guys to be part of this community that I like to call of Entrepreneur 2.0 and be able to leverage technology in order to create yourself a better life and even take control over your life. Because as soon as you become an entrepreneur and as soon as you start to have a sustainable income, then you are the one in control and you don't rely on anybody else. And I believe that's the most important thing that I could advise to anyone is to be in control over your life and your finances and I can assure you that you will see life differently. So I hope that you'll be able to take out some tips and ideas from this video and you will be able to apply it in your own life. That's it for me guys, thank you for listening to me. My name is Alexander Kahn and until the next one, don't forget to live your life to the fullest because life is short, create memories.